Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I could wait until my house is like clean and all put together to put, do this video, but I just want to do a little update video. Like it's not perfect, it's not all put together. We are still moving from the old house. But I want to show you guys some home decor, like some affordable home decor pieces that I've found so far and that I am loving for the house. Um, things are kind of spread out around here. I don't have everything like completely put together space wise, but I like seeing the, the process of it all and I think you guys do too. So that's what I'm about to show you guys. Let me drink some coffee and we're gonna just go around the house. I have like 10 minutes before my kids start to scream, so let's do it fast. Okay, so this is an area that I actually have pretty much set up. I'm just waiting for my mirror to go here. I got like a mirror from Wayfair, like a really big circle mirror that has black edges, which I think is gonna be beautiful because we have a lot of black accents in this house, like with the doors, with the windows. Um, and the first affordable home decor thing that I love are these baskets. Um, I actually use one for Emma's shoes and one for Noah's shoes. You can use them for whatever you want, but I think that they look so pretty like in an entryway. They're just gorgeous. Like they actually look like the quality of them looks just really, really nice. And they were very affordable at Target and I've had my eye on them forever. Um, next up are these really gorgeous vases. They might be out of stock, but I will check and try to link something similar if so. They were like 14 bucks at World Market. Um, I have two, I want to do like a mirror effect here. Um, and then my flowers are actually little like faux cherry blossoms that I got on Amazon. They come in a pack of three, so I actually have like two packs of three in each vase. And they also come in pink, but I just love this white. It almost has like a little pink accent to it anyways. So I found those on Amazon, those are such a good find. Y'all are loving those over on Instagram. Um, I did get some like really pretty decorative books. I got this Architectural Digest book and then also this Live Beautiful book, which are just beautiful. They're neutral, they go with everything, they're just stunning and I got them both on Amazon. This little picture frame is actually from Amazon, just like an eight by 10. It was extremely affordable. I just think that picture is so fun from last 4th of July. Um, and I got these little candles here. I got them both on Amazon. I just like the black and white because a lot of my decor is black and white. And then our rug in here, I'll show you guys, is actually from Wayfair. I have the same rug in my dining room, which is such a hot mess in there right now, so we won't even go over there. But it's actually, and it's crooked right now. But it is literally stunning and I just love it. I really, really love this rug. It's so crooked. Let me fix this. This is what I mean, guys. It's a little bit of a mess in here. But it's just beautiful and I just literally love it so much. And it was extremely affordable. It's always on sale. I will link it for you guys. Wayfair has just like the best deals on rugs and I love this one. So yeah, this entire area is pretty much set up. Like I said, besides I have the big mirror coming, which is also from Wafer. I can link it for you guys. It comes in a ton of sizes and it's just stunning. So I cannot wait to get that. Okay, so if you walk in my house at any given time, you're gonna see this blanket like on the couch, on the floor, someone's cuddling with it. It's just in a pile from last night. It is my absolute favorite Amazon throw blanket. You guys, it is so, so soft. I've had them for so long and this is what the inside looks like. It's so, so comfy. I love the two different sides and we use them all the time. And they're, we get the larger size in the color ivory and my husband's like six foot two and it's long enough for him. I'll actually put it on so you guys can see. <laughs> So here I am with the blanket. It is huge, so comfy. And it's like, I think it's usually, it's always under 40. So maybe it's 39, 37, 36. Amazon fluctuates their prices based on like how popular something is, what the stock is. It is just so good. It reminds me of my Serenoni blankets, which are way more expensive, but I just literally love it. It is so, so comfy so if you're looking for like a great gift i know a lot of you that follow me on instagram have already bought these for yourself for family members i bought them for my mother-in-law and my mom so they're the best um let me show you guys like i do not have my shelf styled yet but i really want to show you guys what i got so far which is not much but i want to show you anyways this is not at all done and this isn't even going to go here but i have these beautiful built-in shelves in this house and I'm just kind of trying to figure out how to style them. I'm literally just ordering stuff and kind of seeing if it works. So the first thing I want to show you guys is this little Vanity Fair book. It's another book I found on Amazon. I just feel like these books are just so beautiful and I might do like another one on top of it. I also am thinking about doing bookends and like doing like just like some of my books that I have and love and just putting them in here. This was actually a little more expensive, but I did get it on sale at Pottery Barn. You could use that in your kitchen or wherever. I just thought it was so beautiful and it kind of brings together like 
the colors in my house with like the wood tones and like some of the black and the neutral black windows all that jazz and then up here this is another piece that i thought was pretty i don't know why but i just thought it was really pretty and it reminds me of like when you go into like a model home and you see like those little sculptures i just thought it was cute so i think i'm actually going to get like another set of them that's like different and put them up there so they're kind of like diagonal from each other um this is just some random cuteness that i probably won't leave here but i am going to do like a huge family gallery wall over here on this wall right here that basically it's like a hallway and this leads up to our stairs so i'm actually gonna do like a huge family gallery wall of pictures and then up here i have this little amazon vase which is incredible i love that vase and then i also got the faux eucalyptus from amazon too so i love that little vase it's very modern like i said like i have a lot of black in the house so it looks really good so those are just some random odds and ends on my shelves right now. Okay, this isn't necessarily home decor, but it's more like home organization. I have my Nespresso machine right here on my countertop and then I have this drawer and I really wanted something to organize my Nespresso pods in. And I got these on Amazon. You can use them for like makeup in your bathroom. I love them in the kitchen, like with these pods. I got some bigger ones here back here. It's like when I just have mixed ones and then I can just kind of organize them by flavor. And then I have like some backup ones right here. So I thought these are really fun and it's kind of a nice way to organize my drawers. They can be used for so many things. Like I said, that like makeup brushes or I don't know, just whatever you have. I really, this was the perfect size for these though, but they also have bigger ones and it came in a set with different sizes. So I'll make sure to link those up for you guys. I just, when I open this in the morning, I'm just like, it just like sings hallelujah to me. I don't know why, I just love it. Okay, next I wanna show you guys some cute things in our master bathroom. I'll also show them to you guys like sitting on the counter. These are so cute and they were out of stock for the longest time on Amazon. I ordered them forever ago. It's like a three, set of three of these little customizable bottles. I'm gonna use them in our guest room. See, I have shampoo, conditioner, and body wash. And they also come in like three different colors. I think they have black, I think they have maybe like a rose gold, I'm not sure. And these are the little stickers that it came with. So there's extra ones too, whether you wanna do like lotion, dish soap, hand wash. I don't know why, but I think they're seriously adorable. And they just remind me of a hotel. So I feel like that's why they'll be so cute in the guest bathroom. I want them for my bathroom too though. So I'm like, mm. I wanted to get like a different color, like the ones with the black or something. Also on my counter in my master, I am obsessed with these little guys. I got them at Target, they're actually pretty big. I have two of them, they're both different sizes. I have my Q-tips in this one. How cute is it? I love it. I think it's the Opal House brand, which I love at Target. And then there's this one that's a little bit bigger and I just have like makeup wipes in there, um, the cotton balls, whatever you have, but they're just so cute on my counter. I literally love them. And then I got this, I actually got two of these. I have one in my, um, just kind of like the powder bathroom downstairs because the kids end up brushing their teeth down there. So they have like their toothbrushes and their toothpaste and everything in this. And this is one for me that I got for my countertop and it's just so nice. It's really heavy duty. It's from Target. It's like so great. It has like a little anti like scratch skid things in the bottom too. And it's like really, really nice. And it just has like three spaces where you can put like all your stuff that you like use every day that you want out on your counter. But then you don't have to have everything out on your counter and it just like has a, has a place, which I literally love. Hold on, I have one more little thing. This is in the same collection as that little um, organizer I just showed you. It's literally just like a little black container, but like the quality is just really good on it. Um, you could do Q-tips in this, cotton balls, whatever. I actually put this on Dylan's side of the bathroom so he could have something to put his stuff in. And he's like, yeah, I'll use that. I also ordered this set for the guest bathroom too for on top of the counters. And literally all four of those are from Target, besides these guys are from Amazon. Um, so I'll show them to you guys like on the counter so you can see what they look like. Here they are, here's my little setup. I usually push this a little bit more into the corner. Scoot that out a little bit so it doesn't take up too much room. I just love it, so cute. And then I wanna get like a tiny little tray here, like a skinnier one that I can put like jewelry in that I'm not wearing, that I like wear often. And then I just take off and put it somewhere like that. Look how pretty these are. So, so cute. I just love little stuff like this. It makes me so happy and I'm just obsessed with those little baskets. I'm trying to think of what else I have to share. I think I'm gonna show you up in my closet. It's basically my office. I have two little really like pretty fashion books. I think I'll show you guys those because I have those on my, styled on my shelves up there and they're from Amazon and they're just so cute. So I will take you upstairs and show you those. 
walking right along here. First, I guess. Okay, going up the stairs. I think I only, yeah, I only have two organizational things, not organizational, decorative things up here right now. But it's just these two little books. And I got them both on Amazon and I thought they were really cute. I actually found them off of another YouTuber um, named Shay and she had them, I think she just did a roundup of them. Like she just did like a roundup of Amazon home decor finds. So that's how where I found them and they're just so cute and they look really pretty. If you have like a little stylish space of your own, I just think they're so cute. And this is my shelf so far. Kind of a little bit messy, but not too bad. Those ones still need stuff up top. I just walked down to my closet and realized these are the pink ones from Amazon. I need to figure out what to do with these. They're so pretty. I'd love to put them in Emma's room because she loves pink, but I feel like she would just knock over the vase or something. So I might put them upstairs, kind of where I was just showing you guys and get like, I think I have an extra one of those vases and I might put this like on my table in my office up there because they're really, really pretty. And they're the same ones as the white ones. They're just, you just choose um, the pink. I think this is two sets of them. So they come in a set of three. So it would be like this when you order them on Amazon. So I would get, I think two kind of fills up the vase really nicely if you have a bigger one, but if you have a smaller vase, you could just do one set. Okay, my bedroom's not put together at all. I haven't even made the bed, but I did have one more find I wanted to share. Um, this is actually Pottery Barn um, pillowcase and an Amazon insert, so I can link those for you guys. I showed those to y'all on stories too. I love those inserts, they're like really poofy. Um, these, you guys, look how pretty these are. I got these at Target. They're little poofs and they're just so, so cute. They match my rug, they match my, I have like the black mirror in here, which they match. What's up? Um, they're just so, so cute. I love them. They come in multiple colors um, and they literally like, they just match my bedroom perfectly. So I can kind of toss those anywhere. I usually put them like at the end of the bed or, you know, just around the room to add like some comfort, just like a cute little look. So I just love these guys. I'll link them for you. And once again, Target, Target for the win on the home decor stuff these days. So cute. Okay, that's everything. It was a quick little video, but I just want to show you guys like a couple areas that I feel like I've purchased things for and like that are starting to come together and I see their future and their plan, but like obviously it's not all the way there. Sorry, I'm just like trying to fix this hair situation. I haven't had my hair cut in a hot minute, so it's it's falling so weird. Um, but anyways, I have not been on YouTube as much and I, you guys have been messaging me like, hey, haven't seen your YouTube videos. I've just been so busy and I've been making less of them, but it's not something I wanna to continue to do. I wanna get into making more of them. So y'all just have to let me know what you wanna see in the comments down below. Um, if you ever like, where are you? I'm always on Instagram. Like Instagram is my place. I am there on stories like every single day. Um, but I'm trying to get better about being here on YouTube more and y'all are awesome. I appreciate every one of you that watch my YouTube videos and those of you who have subscribed. If you have not subscribed, I would love for you guys to subscribe. I never know how to ask people to subscribe or to get more subscribers. So I guess just subscribe. <laughs> I never know what to say. Um, but anyways, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time.